Welcome to Tech New Tips, where we explore the latest innovations and technologies from around the world. Today, we're diving into a fascinating construction technique that could change the way we test foundations for future buildings. Imagine the sound of a heavy 20-ton block of iron being pushed out of a cylindrical device with a loud clang. This is part of a unique technique known as the in-hole impact testing method. It's not yet widely used, but it could revolutionize how we test the strength of foundation piles for future skyscrapers. Normally, construction engineers would stack heavy stones, sometimes weighing between 500 and 1,200 tons, on top of a foundation pile. They'd then measure how deep the pile sinks into the ground to determine its load-bearing capacity. This process, while effective, can be cumbersome and time-consuming. To simplify things, engineers have developed this cylinder device. Instead of piling tons of stones, a 20-ton iron block is used. Here's how it works. At the bottom of the pile, a piston is attached and a controlled amount of gunpowder is placed inside. When the gunpowder ignites, it creates pressure, pushing the iron block upwards while applying a downward force on the pile. This process involves Newton's second and third laws of motion. As the iron block is pushed upward, the pile feels an equal downward force. By calculating the acceleration of the block and its mass, engineers can simulate forces up to 400 tons or more, all with just a 20-ton iron block. By using this technique, engineers can efficiently test whether a foundation pile is strong enough to support a building without the need for tons of stone. If the pile passes the test, construction can proceed. This breakthrough technology simplifies the process of testing foundation piles and speeds up construction projects. Have you ever seen this type of experiment in action? Let us know in the comments. After a transformer station is built, engineers conduct a crucial test to ensure everything is functioning safely. They use a special machine to launch a copper wire grounded to the electrical grid at high voltage. When the copper wire hits the ground, it creates a massive short circuit, causing the wire to instantly vaporize. This test helps engineers gather critical data about the power lines, including how well the transformer station can handle electrical faults. It also checks if the system can automatically cut off the power when something goes wrong and whether the system can quickly recover after the fault. In some cases, engineers use drones to perform artificial short circuit tests. This method is safer and easier to control especially when working with high-voltage power lines. The drone precisely places the wire, allowing for a more controlled short circuit. Artificial short circuit testing is a vital step in ensuring that power stations can safely handle electrical issues. It's an impressive sight to see, with high-voltage vaporizing metal in an instant. What do you think about this cutting-edge test? Share your thoughts below. From construction to power testing, these cutting-edge methods are shaping the future of engineering. Have you ever seen anything like these tests before? Let us know in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to Tech New Tips for more fascinating innovations from around the world.